Welcome back, everyone. Uh, welcome to another uh, Forex trading week. Uh, so today we are going to be doing uh, reviewing the week of uh, June 13 to the 17. Uh, so let's get to work. Let me show you what the market has to offer. If you guys have any question, please let me know in the comment below. Okay. So let's go ahead and start with the first pair, guys. The first pair that I'm going to give it to you guys is it is Euro GBP. Pay close attention what Euro GBP is doing. It's very, very, very important, guys, to always pay attention what the dashboard is doing. Uh, look at here, four hours is letting us know the market is still selling. The daily time frame is also confirming that we are in a buy position. So, what is the meaning of the four hours? That means the four hours is doing a pullback. So here it is. So the next thing we need to look for our multiple time frame to go in the same direction of our TWE. There's your our multiple time frame. Our TWE is not entry, confirming that we are in a buy position. When the market is bullish. You are going to be looking for this green uh, stairs going going up. So that is exactly what the trend is doing on Euro GBP. Look at here. It's clearly telling you the market is only going up. So <clears throat> right now, what you are seeing here is the market is giving us an indication the market is doing a what? What do you think this represents here? That it is a pullback. So market right as we speak here is doing a pullback as a sell position. So mark on Friday, the market still left that as a sell position. It's retesting your 23.6 Fibonacci level. In my opinion, market is gonna come back to your 38.2 Fibonacci level. And from here, we're gonna resume back to business. Remember, the buyers are in charging here. Then from here, we're gonna continue going on that buy position, all right? So guys, I'm not giving you a signal, nothing like that. This is for educational purpose. I just wanted to make sure that everybody understand this. Our Forex disclaimer, please do not trade any money. You cannot afford to lose this business. Very risky. You can win huge. At the same time, you can blow your account. If you don't know how to trade you want me to help you guys please let me know this coming tuesday guys i will be doing a zoom call with one of the traders actually two traders they want me to do a private 101 if you want to participate please let me know in the comment below send me a private telegram the link is on the description of this video and i will be more than happy to bring you aboard so you can learn and a different idea i mean you can learn it you know from me if you like it well, if not, but I'm pretty sure you will love it. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and review the next pair that I have for you guys. Guys, uh, one, another quick thing before I move on to the next pair. Uh, I know here on our channel, guys, uh, I always want to be honest, transparent, and I'm here to give you the best tips, tricks, analysis, and strategy here on the Forest channel. So make sure everyone, if you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell notification so you don't ever miss any content from our from our channel all right let's go ahead and give you the next pair of the day so the next pair that i'm gonna give you it is usd jpy oh my god look at what usd jpy is doing guys look at the dashboard look at this one all the way from one month every single time frame is telling you that we are going only on a buy position that's what the market is doing guys Guys, I will be giving you about probably four or five pairs this week. If you want me to analyze a different pair that I may not cover today, uh, let me know in the comment below or send me a private telegram. I answer Irving, can you make a video on this particular pair? And I will make a short video so you can see it. The pair may go on our way, it may not, but the goal here is not for you to be paying for signal. I'm giving you here an educational video so you can learn in real time what the market is gonna do. Because a lot of traders, they will be talking about this move here. Look at here, they will tell you, oh, if you would've put a buy on this multiple time frame, you wouldn't make all this money here. My goal is to give you data that does not exist. I may be right, I may be wrong, but I'm going with the trend, so I always wanna be trading with the trend so in here all i can see is the market is going up so our multiple time frame in here is telling us that we're still in going in a buy position look at the stairs look at what the tw sniper enter is doing look at the stairs one two three four and five there's a brand new stairs two brand new stairs they just pop in here so that means the market here is clearly going only in one direction that is bullish so and here the market is forming and telling you hey i'm getting ready for what 
If the market is in a buy position and, and, and the multiple time frame is forming here and telling you the market is gonna do what? It's gonna do a pullback. So market is, <clears throat> is getting ready for a small pullback as a sell position, all right? That's what I'm seeing here. So now, if I had to analyze this, oh, this is what my my weekly analysis is gonna be doing. So remember, all we're doing today, guys, is we are doing our weekly forex uh, forecast. All right. So all we're doing is I'm gonna be looking for the market to continue up, retesting uh, our trend line in here, and from here we I'm expecting to see a red arrow to show up in this area here. And this red arrow here will give me the signal for this sell position. Remember, it's a short sell that you are looking for here. So I'm looking for a 23.6 Fibonacci level to come and retest that level in there. And then from there, I will continue as a buy position. Remember, the buyers are in charge on USDJPY at this present time. Please, please, please always be careful. Another reminder to everyone, guys, always check the news. No matter what I say today, the uh, news is subject to change based on whatever the market is going to be releasing. All right. So you can, if you don't know how to read the news, go into our website. There is a tab that says Forex Analysis. You can review all the um, coming um, news that are going to be coming this coming week. All right. So always pay attention to that. If you guys need help, just let me know, guys. Uh, like I said, you know, I can make a short video and help you out, okay? All right, so stay with me, guys. I don't know if you guys are going to follow one or two or three or four or five or all six pairs that I'm going to be giving you today. I don't know which one is going to be the your one, the one that you're going to be trading. But to be honest, me particularly, guys, I'm looking for USDJPY as a sell position. But I don't have that. Uh, I don't have the data yet for me. So I'm being patient on the market sitting on this pair here so I can take that sell position. All right. All right. So let's move on to the next pair of the day. So the next pair is going to be GBP USD. Pay close attention. GBP USD is look at the dashboard, guys. This is so damn beautiful. Look at that. All the way from 50 minute all the way to one month. The market here is selling. That is the trend that is doing now. So if the trend is selling, what should I do? Should I look for buy or should I look for sell? Well, what do you think? What will you do? Because look, I'm doing this for you guys. Look, the whole purpose for me to do this weekly analysis guy is for you to stop paying for signals. Learn how to trade. Look, the market is subject to change. Anything that I tell you today, market can go on the wrong side of the aisle. But at least I have an educated uh, opinion of where to go. Guys, if anyone in here wants to get this free indicator, this trend line in here, let me know in the comment below and I will hand it to you. So this trend line in here, it works so magically with our multiple time frame. When it comes here, look, it come and retest that uh, trend line, same thing in here, multiple time frame came in here. So the buyers, and, and when it was a buy, it came here exactly and it took off. Sell and it took off and it's selling right now. It's beautiful, 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 beautiful piece of uh, indicator in there but let me know if you want it and I hand it over to you all right so okay like I said everything here looks sell so if we look at multiple time frame here it's saying Irving we are selling our TW sniper entries brand new guys for all those traders that are anywhere in the world and are planning to trade this GBP USD if you are selling this bad boy here you guys were on profit or left on profit or took your profit on Friday so congratulations to you guys because to be honest market is doing exactly exactly what you what i'm telling you here okay so i'm super happy guys uh i'm super happy to be honest uh to let you know that uh market is selling so uh, we should say hell yeah right all right so uh let's go ahead and move on to the next pair of the day oh actually i haven't even give you this one so what i'm seeing here on gbp usd is market still gonna continue selling down it's gonna come back to your 78.6 fibonacci level and from here we are gonna be looking for a small retracement a pullback retesting your 61 to your 50 fibonacci level so there's multiple levels in here look at this one so this is very nice area very key area for the market to come back in here that will continue as a sell position. Overall, what I'm seeing here on GBPUSD, guys, market still selling. That's all I'm seeing. 
if you are seeing something else and guys one pair that i totally forgot to make a video last week was uh usd 30. if anybody in here is trading uh usd 30 as a sell congratulations because usd 30 it is on fire guys it's on fire selling like it's hot so oof so that was one pair that I was trading and boom, and I'm still on sale, okay? All right, let's move on to the next pair, guys. The next pair that I have here is gonna be gold. Um, here it is, look at gold. Look at what gold is doing, guys. Gold is beautiful, beautiful selling down. I'm, so, I'm sorry, going up. Look at the dashboard. Look at what the dashboard said. Look at the, the daily all the way to one to five minutes, 50 minutes, market is buying. So what is our multiple time? Look, I've been telling you this for two weeks, guys. I've been telling you since the since this trend commenced, the market was gonna be in a buy position and it's still bullish. Look at our multiple time frame with the trend line that I, if you guys want this trend line, let me know in the comment below and I'll give it to you. Okay. Look at what here, multiple time frame come right at the trend line in here. Say hey, it's time for that buy position to take over. Look at our TW sniper entry also confirming. Hey, it came right on it as well. And look at the stairs the stairs don't lie guys the stairs telling you here that we are still going where are we going up or are we going down boom market took off so market here sell i'm sorry is buying so here's a continuation of the buy the trend is bullish if it's bullish only look for buy position if it's selling only look for sell position but the market here is is, is still going up there's the green arrow so what's my understanding for this week, guys? This is a brand new week, what, what we're gonna be trading, uh, right? This is for the week of the 13th to the 17th. So uh, so what I'm seeing here is the market still going up, like I say. So market, in my opinion, will continue pushing maybe another 30, 40 more pip, going to your 78.6 Fibonacci. Even though the market already did respect this multiple time frame here, it came and retested this multiple time frame in here. But I believe the market may push another, give you a long weekend here. And then from there, what I'm looking for here is I'm looking for the market to do a small retracement to retest your 61.8 Fibonacci. To be honest, I'm not I'm not interested on to take a sell in here. I'm interested on the market to give me this uh, green arrow to pop in and here and say, Irvin, it's time for you to continue going on that buy position. So I want to, if I, I want to trade gold, I say buy position because that's what the original trend is doing. All the, if all the white shows up on man, maybe Monday or Tuesday, then you know the whole uh, analysis will change. But all I can see right now is the market still bullish. That's all it's doing. It's not doing anything else. All right. What do you guys think so far, guys? Uh, hopefully everyone in here is finding value on this video guys i'm giving you the best uh, forex weekly forecast for free there's no charge uh, a lot of you guys you know pay probably signal stop paying for signal learn how to trade you can learn how to trade with me and uh, no charge all right so and um so let me know guys what do you guys think what do you guys think guys let's go so guys i want to uh make sure i uh, bring it up to i want to thank everybody for being here guys and uh for watching our video and uh make sure you everybody subscribe and so you don't ever miss any video from us so once again guys always stay healthy god bless you god bless your family god bless our beautiful nation the united states of america and god bless the world as well so like i always say guys stay safe and i will see you back on the next video okay love you guys bye bye